Welcome to the fifth alien level. The most annoying alien level, but not the hardest. Or I would say the meanest alien level. Not even really the most annoying. Welcome to Gateway. Oh, I'm, sure, I'm sure one of the bonus levels is more annoying than this level. Although it does have that noise in this level. Not really sure what that noise is from. Don't think it's this elevator. If it is the elevator, the elevator needs oil. And a completely unnecessary stealth maneuver. It's actually costing me more help. They didn't randomly take off their heads like usual. Attention, dark personnel. The R&D tower has been breached. We are evacuating transit sections 1, 2, and 3. Security teams, remain at your posts. And everyone, please follow standard company emergency procedures. Uh, yeah. Reading from a sheet was so hard. So, you can see, I don't usually use this app because it's not really great. I mean, it does more damage than the fire. Than I mean, it, it tracks, so you don't actually have to aim that much, but you don't need to aim with the claw, so it's not really necessary. I don't know. <laughs> I thought that was coming back for me. Uh, but it wasn't. So, here's where the level gets sort of mean. I can try to showcase it. I don't want to cost myself too much health here. Uh, see the turret down there? You wouldn't be able to hear or see or anything. You just have to know that you need to jump across the gap. Oh. Take that guy out. Delicious. Although I don't think it's ever established in the movies that the aliens eat anything, really. Not that I know of. So, I guess took out the lights, too. I, I always say it's cool in systems, but apparently this time it's also the lights. Enough of that. As soon as the alien fits through numerous small spots, I can try to showcase one a little bit later, which is incredibly small. The alien shouldn't really be able to fit through it. Like, here it's sort of small, but not as small as you can get it later. <laughs> I think he just actually shot her, but we won't tell anybody. There, there's one broken one. This alien is huge. Huge. Biggest alien ever. So, I guess I haven't really showcased it in any of the levels, but the lighting actually does have an effect on whether or not the Marines can see you. So you can take out the lights and then they won't be able to see you and you can sneak up on them more. But usually not even worth it. The bells are here. How are you doing with those egg specimens? Get them down dug for as soon as possible. The earthbound ship is ready to dug and load. That's right, it is. It's ready to load some aliens. One of the few places in the game with glass. It occurs less often than water, I think. I'm not sure if that fan turns off or not. It doesn't have a green light, so I'm not gonna worry about it. Because green means go. I think you can sort of climb on the marines, but. Uh. See, if you didn't know where you were supposed to be going, this could be slightly confusing. But there's a furnace, the sweet fire effects. <laughs> Just waste time and show those to you. Not very important to the gameplay. Kind of wondering what the marines are doing in the vents in the first place now. 
And also, those power boxes were powering. <laughs> Random body parts falling. Where did those even come from? They're gone now, but I would think if they at least came from a vent that I was just in or something, but... And this is slightly secret. If you've ever played a level before, you know, but the way you have to go is for the blinking light. Otherwise, it looks just like the corridor I was in before. I'd be like, I want to go in this one. But it's just a circle. Completely unnecessary, I'm not doing it. <laughs> now, this is another really annoying part, because the game doesn't tell you you have to be fairly quick here, otherwise you're going to get shot by some turrets. Okay, right there. <laughs> Luckily I was most of the way down the hall, so it didn't really affect me. But could have been worse. Probably going to get killed or something here. You guys hearing this? We've encountered multiple hostiles and they are not xenomorphs! I repeat, they are not xenomorphs! These guys have some serious firepower, but we've taken heavy casualties! Oh! Dock 4 is no longer secure! Cancel the earthbound ship! I say again, Dock 4 is no longer secure! Are you guys hearing this? Are you hearing this? These guys are dead! Look at those effects. Quality movie making. This is German infantry helmet with a camcorder taped to it or something. So I guess that was a good chance to show off the 180 degree thing. But if you weren't paying attention, I didn't say anything. And there's a predator. You can see they have the fancy green thing, aura, whatever you want to call it. You can also tell the invisibility isn't very invisible, especially for the alien. You can try to stab me. It's not very successful. That's not a knife. This is a knife. Usually that tail kills him right away, but didn't work very well. So now I have his head. It's delicious, delicious head. Worth much more health than the human head. Mm, there's a plasma casting predator, so we're just gonna take him out right away. <laughs> his little fleshy body parts will <laughs> roll across the... I think that's his helmet, his mask. I, I don't even know what that is. That's his head, so I have no idea what that is. <laughs> the rest of his body is there. Well, whatever it was, it was bleeding. And this is the end of the level. Hopefully you've enjoyed the alien campaign. Because the alien is going to Earth, and he'll never see you again. Going a nice vacation there. Woo!